Good evening world. Um, welcome to my channel, I guess. Um, uh, not really my channel, my parents' channel. Anyway, um, what about that lighting? <laughs> um, I guess, as the video title suggests, I will be making my Halloween costume in this video, which I'm really excited about because, um, in a few days, I don't know four days maybe um Halloween is here and if you guys don't know I am obsessed with Halloween I love the costumes it's just it's so much fun and every year I always try to make my own costume in a way last year I was blurry face from 21 pilots and it wasn't that good but the year before that, I was Castiel from Supernatural, and I made my own wings that actually expanded. And this year, I am not being a character, but I'm being um, an elf. <laughs> so I ordered my little pointy ears off Amazon yesterday, and they should be here Tuesday, I think. Um... What else? Um, and today we will be picking up the material that I'm using to make a little, a little elfish cloak. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> and then I will be sewing that into an actual elven cloak. That made no sense. <sighs> Hello! I'm back. So, I got the material from Walmart. <laughs> they didn't have the color I wanted, but I settled for a nice shade of blue. It's also bigger than I needed, but it was only $8.88, so can't really beat that price. Um, what else? Ooh, where did it go? <laughs> There's a button I got to. I don't know where that is right now. Somewhere. We'll find it. Oh, I found the buttons. These are it. There's a piece of cilantro. <laughs> it was in the trash, actually. Um, we bought some more stuff from Walmart, and my mom thought that it was just a piece of paper. She didn't see the buttons on it, so she just put it in the garbage bag and <laughs> threw it into the trash can. It's okay. I found it. So we're going to make that after I finish eating lunch. It is exactly 12. We're gonna eat some lunch and then we're gonna go and make this. I think I'm gonna start printing out the pattern since it's 27 pages now. So when I'm done with my lunch, I can start making it. Yay. So I have started the printing. I don't know if you can probably hear it over there. Um, but they give you a little um, size test to make sure that your printer is printing out the correct papers and to make sure the pattern is correct and stuff. And then all the sizing was correct according to the size test, which it's like a one inch, uh, one centimeter, three centimeters, three inches. And yeah, we're just printing the 27, 29 pages now. Um, it's gonna take a while, so I'm gonna go eat. And yeah, I'll come back to you guys when I have everything printed out. And I'm assembling it. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I forgot my printer does double sided. <laughs> I'm so glad I found it out earlier. Okay, uh, BRB. Printing. And this is the size checker in which you can see that that is indeed one centimeter. I'm gonna go eat, like I said. I just finished sewing the main body of the cloak. So the side areas and then the little thingy back panel. Um, right now, I am in the process of putting together the hood and the hood lining. And then I'm gonna sew it on the main body and my cloak's gonna be basically done. I just have to put the buttons on and then try it on and see how it works. 
And I'm excited because my ears should be coming Tuesday. So then I'm gonna do a little makeup test on Wednesday and have some fun. And then it's Halloween on Thursday. So everything's coming together really good. I'll update you guys again when I have everything sewn together and put into a nicer shape than what it is right now. It looks kind of tacky because nothing is hemmed and nothing is, it's very just kind of fresh, just made newly sewn cloak. Yeah. So this is like a bunch of days later. <laughs> it is no longer the 27th. As I said in the beginning of this video, we be lying. Um, it is actually Tuesday. My ears have come. Check out for the next video. She'll be uploaded soon right after this one. So we are on that YouTube grind. <laughs> I hate how much I use that word. Anyway. Um, I forgot to make an outro for this video, which I found very inappropriate. I feel like I shouldn't have done that. But to not leave you guys in the dust of what the cloak looks like, I'm gonna show you guys real now. Real now, right now. I'm not going to put it on because I just put it on. <laughs> so I'm gonna go over here and I'll be back. This is what the cloak looks like on the hanger. Um, it has a little little hood. It's very cute. And the little button. She's right here. She's so cute. Oh, it's such a cute cloak. Um, it's very soft. I ended up not hemming because it is just a temporary cloak that I want to do for Halloween. If I actually wanted to do a serious one. I would use a different pattern. It was my own mistake with the pattern for not measuring the shoulder across, the shoulder across back here, because it ended up being too long, so it looks kind of funky, but we fixed it, it's okay. So yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's very chill, not really. I'm editing it right now, <laughs> so <laughs> it's very short. I wanted my first video to be kind of short. Um, I may make another video that includes the ferrets more since it is their channel, <laughs> of course. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time my boys, stay positive. <laughs>